paraphilia means strange and unusual, uh, non-normative sexual behavior. Uh, it's set up, the literature suggests it's set up, but also my experience it's set up uh, in the family of origin. Uh, the research, such as it is, indicates that um, the male sexual template is formed between 7 and 9, or 7 and 11, which is a very uh, particular age. Uh, but it's formed not from sexual experience, it's formed from uh, domestic experience, things happening in, in, the, in the family. Uh, and uh, uh, so with bearing that in mind, I'll talk about Charles. He came here uh, because uh, his acting out behaviors were so destructive to him. Uh, they uh, terribly uh, uh, demeaned him, really. Um, and uh, I'll talk about his behaviors and then uh, talk something about his history. He's given me permission to, to, to talk about this. Young man, he came here probably in his middle 20s. He's now in his early 30s. Um, and he was in a treatment program for compulsive sexual behavior. Uh, I remember one, one uh, evening uh, he came across almost possessed and he was looking at his phone and what he had was a, a, an appointment uh, to see a sex worker of a particular kind and he left the building as quickly as possible and drove, I don't know, 60 miles or something to see this woman. Um, and over the years, um, uh, he's been through our treatment program, he's seen me individually, uh, we've tried every conceivable um, uh, approach to uh, mitigate this, keep it from happening, even aversion therapy. Not aversion therapy using shocks, but aversion therapy using a noxious odor. In this case, we used uh, smelling salts. Didn't work. Um, and he was bound, and it's interesting because addiction means, uh, comes from the Latin adesari, which means to be taken over by something more powerful than oneself.